Hello everyone, welcome back to a brand new video, and in case you couldn't tell, we're starting a brand new hardcore world. I did have a series on YouTube, but the problem was it was so far behind in both updates and posting that it was really delayed. And so I'm creating a brand new world, and yeah, I'm going to make this a series, and if you guys like it, make sure to like the video so I can make more. Also, if you guys do end up having like suggestions on how I can fix the video, make it better, I love reading those kinds of comments. So what we're going to do, got it on hardcore mode, we'll name it Pixelated Funny World, like that, change that, and there. So I have not played this new update yet, and I'm really excited to try it out. <gasps> Yo, hold up, hold up. Did they, did they change the dog texture? When do they do that? That is that is so cool. Oh, I love it. It's so cute. If I had bones, I would tame him. Um, okay. This is not a good bot. Actually, this might be a pretty decent area for me to spawn in. Obviously, the first thing we need to do is grab some wood so that we can make a crafting table and then we'll get some stone tools and some iron. And hopefully they don't have a set. So I'm not exactly sure what most of these biomes have to offer. It's, it's been a while since I've played Minecraft. I missed a log right there. That, that's an, that's an azalea tree. Hold up. I don't know if we should dig down or not. I think I'm going to because there's not much else to do. And I'm, oh, okay. I ran into some water. Uh. Mm, let's see here. There's a pool. Oh, okay. This is just a, where a lake is. Okay. I thought that was going to be like a cool little ocean path area. Uh, I'm going to move over a little bit. So I don't drown. It also looks like they changed the bubble UI a little bit. Because like now there's like the, the bubble slots. And that's new for sure. I know the first rule of Minecraft is not to mine straight down, but can you- I feel like I'm missing something. I feel like there should be rooted dirt over here, but there isn't any. I'm not sure if that means I'm going the wrong direction- Oh wait, there! I see- I see some, uh, moss. It's always a good sign. Okay. Should be too up high of a drop. Okay! Ah! Okay! That could have been really bad. Okay, the world could have ended right there. Whew. Okay, now I, I'm really stressed now. I need to be more careful. I'm going to die so fast. I'm also going to make a sword so I can at least protect myself if something bad shows up. Okay, so what we need to do next is get some iron. Because I feel pretty unsafe. Some gold right there. There's some iron. It's too high up though. Diamonds! <laughs> no shot! I already found diamonds and we just started this. Okay, that is a great. I think that means that we're going to survive. And I forgot that those break instantly. Okay. okay what I want to do though is. I kind of want to go to the surface so I can at least get some food. Because right now, I'm running very low on health and I don't want to die yet. Sandstone. That's a good sign. Oh, okay. That's sand, which means I'm on the beach. Close enough to land, right? <laughs> Might as well just build it a little spiral this way. But finally! Sunlight, beautiful, beautiful sunlight. Okay, it's glorious. There, so I'm sorry, chicken, but <gasps> hey, child, I'm so sorry. I'm gonna grab some mushrooms. They gave me an egg at the very least, so I can thank them for that. Uh, click some of this just in case I can never make mushroom stew. I guess I could have just headed down that ravine, and that might have been smarter. 
But digging down is a safer alternative. I see some more chickens. Okay, it found a new parent. That means you, you must be the victim. I'm sorry. There we go. Two chicken does not seem like enough. It doesn't seem like much mobs spawn here, though. So, uh, have to work with what I got. I also need to find some coal so I can make some torches and have an actual fuel source because I do not think that wooden pickaxes are going to last me a while. Also, I'm going to make an axe because why not? Salmon. Come here, little salmon. There we go. Eradicate the salmon population. Doing some good for the environment. Come here. Don't <laughs> escape your destiny. That should be all we need. The rest we can just... And plus it's getting night time. So I'm going to go back down into that cave. And get those sweet diamonds and coal that we need. If I can find where I came from. Right here. Yes. Oh, there's some coal. We'll keep our stuff right here and go ahead and smelt some of that so we can have some iron tools and iron armor to get those sweet diamonds down there. There's a creeper, some lapis, uh, but other than that, it doesn't seem like there's actually that much. We'll need to explore more. Yeah, it's nighttime now. <laughs> I'm going to have to be extra careful. Yeah, see Enderman right down there. Baby zombie! A lot of creepers. Okay, I'm also going to try and make a shield because, well, for obvious reasons. <laughs> I don't feel like I need to explain myself much on that. So first thing I'm going to make is a shield because I know for a fact that I can be protected with this. I think it's F. There we go. Look at me with my stylish shield. I finally look like a true warrior. Uh, I could make boots, but... I have enough, and I'm going to make a chest plate. Now that that's done, we'll cook some salmon, make an iron chest plate, and... Bam! I already feel much more protected. There, now I'm ready to head down into that cave. But, I'm also going to need to find out... Well, not find out, but get enough iron so that I can make an iron pickaxe because this one is pretty close to breaking and I want one that's much stronger. Two creepers. Okay, baby zombie. Oh, he's he's stuck. <laughs> okay. Got to be very oh, he's right there. He can't get up. Okay. Okay. Nice. Oh. Okay. I'm playing strategic here. Uh, see, I'm smart. To all the people in the comments... Oh, wait, where's the... Oh, he's there. To all the people in the comments that say I'm not smart, get humbled. Hopefully there's three in here. Please. No, there's not. Where's the... Is there any more iron? Some right there that I can get. Can you be quiet, please? I do not... Okay, yeah, that that is great. Okay. I have enough to craft two pickaxes, so that works out. But I did not think that was going to break so soon. One piece of iron. We'll go ahead and craft a an iron pickaxe. Ah, uh, ha! Ah. I feel much better now. I feel like I can do anything. As long as I'm not stupid. Please be more than one diamond. <laughs> okay. One diamond's better than no diamonds at the very least. Deep slated coal. Isn't that one of the rarest ores to find? Or is it deep slated emerald? I can't remember which is more rare. I think deep slated coal. There is a lot of this, isn't there? Yeah, step this way. Right this way. Hold up! 
Oh, I wasn't... I don't think I was putting up my shield. That was not smart of me at all. Okay, I can eat now. I need, I need to be a lot... Think! Think, bro. I need to just tank. Use my brain a little bit. That seems to be everything this ravine has to offer. So I think I'm going to head back up to the surface. I just realized my microphone was off like the past four minutes, but I was basically talking about how I wanted to leave and there's nothing interesting. And then I found the shipwreck. I haven't explored it yet, but thankfully I noticed my microphone was off before, you know, I continued the video. So let's see. Ooh, okay. That's really good. Emeralds, iron nuggets, uh, gold. We don't need sand. We can keep that in there. There we go. Hold up. Wait, wait. Paper. A buried treasure map. We'll have a clock, just in case. We'll take some paper. We'll find this buried treasure. That is not super far away, but... Oh, this is ice. This is ice. Hold up. Wait. There we go. I, I don't know what was happening. So, I think there should be one more treasure chest, and it should be in here. Okay, I cannot find it, but we're going to see if we can find this buried treasure real quick. I think I've seen it go this way, right? Let me make sure. This wilderness is wildernessing. Okay. They need to make it where boats can, like, drift through on and off water and ice. <laughs> it's... Horrible having to do this a lot closer. Good. So we're right back where we ended up. Well, where we were, but now with a buried treasure map and a... What? Okay, that scared me really badly. Die, please. Just... Okay. That was horrible. Oh, okay. There's a lot of zombies. Okay, there's a lot of zombies. <laughs> There's a lot of zombies. Okay, so it looks like it's frozen right over this land. Just need to position myself correctly. Right there, I think. Right here. And then just stick straight down. So it should be under here. If I am correct. Which I always am, so... There, ah, see, I was exactly right, too. Perfect. It's in it. Beautiful. This is beautiful. You don't need normal dirt, and that seems pretty good to me. Stop, stop, stop. Okay. There we go. Okay, I, I, I forgot about the heart of the seed. Uh, let me go ahead and get that. There we go. Uh, we'll replace it with the torch that I honestly don't need right now. And yeah, that should be everything that treasure has to offer. I do actually want these bones, so I'm going to drop... Uh, what do I not really need? Drop these clay and pick up some bones, and I might as well also... I can get rid of the paper, because I can just grow that. I'm gonna get some arrows. Next, we need to find a village, at the very least. Okay, the sun's rising. That should make things a lot easier. Okay, finally, I found something of some nutritional value. I apologize, cow. I bet you would've lived a great life, if only I hadn't been here. Hey! <laughs> I'm so sorry. It's beautiful. A biome other than a taiga or an ice spikes. I'm so happy. Finally. Oh, it took way too long to find this, honestly. It's already... Like, where's the sun? It's already past midday. That's how long that took. From night to midday. The village! <laughs> okay, guys. This might just be the greatest first episode anyone could ever ask for. I thought the- I could have sworn the wolf skins were different. I thought they were black in the Tega earlier. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure they were. Let's go- <gasps> A cherry blossom! Right beside it! 
This is perfect. This is actually perfect. Oh, this is a good sized village. What do they have? They have a nice, they have a lot of farmers. Very big on the agricultural business, I see. Nice. You guys look pretty chill. What do you have to offer? Oh! Uh, um. <clears throat> well, um, that was an accident. Okay, these are actually some really good traders. Okay, villages. Why did I say traders? That is weird. I meant trades. Good trades. A cleric? He probably has a brewing stand in here. Yes. Is this a... Well, this isn't a blacksmith. A lot of leather, so... Ooh! There's a lot of beautiful food that I am going to steal from them. We don't need that cobblestone. Have this bread and we... No, I need to eat some salmon anyways. Go to get that out of my inventory and replace it with some bread. And the emeralds can go right there. We don't need any potatoes right now, but... We'll just place that with my stone axe. And you see, while I could kill his iron golem, or their iron golem, I'm already completely decked out in full iron armor. So, you're safe for today, bro. Don't worry. So, honestly, I think that'll be the end of this episode. In the next episode, I think I'll see how big that biome is, what's all around this village, and maybe start working on more exploring. I'll try and make a map, maybe build a house. I, I haven't decided yet. I haven't thought that far. But if you guys want to see another video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And let me know down in the comments below how I can improve the videos. So yeah, I hope you guys have an amazing day. Uh, I hope I see you guys again soon. Thank you for watching. Bye!